Hudson. We finished analyzing that mainframe that Mason Woods brought from Yamato. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleeper agents Dragovich used in 68. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus erased them. Fuck me. There's only one place you're gonna find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know. But we're gonna do this the right way, or we're not gonna do it at all. The Lubyanka building, KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Алло, Беликов на трубке. Извините, я думал, что это песок с пол Сингапура. We're almost to the tunnels. Did you get access to the bunker? always a problem. Solve it. We're getting the files in that bunker. Do whatever it takes. And one more thing. One of our East Berlin informants recently switched sides and fled for Moscow. We have reason to believe he's in the Lubyanka building today. He knows too much about our Berlin network. I'm thinking an early retirement. Good man. Now I know why Hudson thinks so highly of you. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Governor Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. I'm sorry, we just have to go back to you. I see. Did the general come through here? It's this is just fine to see. Have you ever been to Comrade Belikov, have a seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. 
There's a mole within the KGB. <clears throat> the committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. <clears throat> thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov, as head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this moon. How is that gone? I am not a patient man, Bilikov, or a compassionate one. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. I also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, Belikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? <coughs> Comrade Belikov, my apologies. Even your bunker access has been revoked. We can't be too cautious, can we? Secretary Gorbachev, I believe it would be best if only General Charkov retains his bunker key for now. Very well. See to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. <laughs> the traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Belikov, you are dismissed. <laughs> I'm being watched. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted, oh, can I help you, sir? my cover. Now I need to hide the body. I have to get a bunker key for Adler. He'll need it to access the vault. <sighs> Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one.
Берегов, have you dug up my mole yet? No matter. We've discovered additional unauthorized communications. Within hours, we will know the exact computer they came from. Comrade. Ugh. I will be exposed soon. In the server room, I could point evidence towards Cherkov. Get shit out of me. Help. You need my help. Save your breath. Ivanov won't cooperate. Yet. I should find leverage in the records room. Ivanov won't cooperate. Yet. I should find leverage in the records room. If I'm seeing this would be treason. KGB has his wife and daughter's abductions already planned. That's good. I can use this to my advantage.
my family have to do with any of this? What? What must I do? Kill him? Uh, I'll try. But swear to this, my own life for my family. just heard the most amusing thing. Let's chat once I'm finished here. Comrade, how's our friend doing? I don't know, sir. He doesn't have much to say. Oh, we'll see about that. Zerizel Ivanov, I trust you're enjoying your accommodations. We have a situation in the holding cell. Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler's team in. Can I help you, sir? Two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. Bielica here, send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately! I'm sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I?
This keycard gives you elevated access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Bell, take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Там, там, там. Я нашел не запертую дверь. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить. Понятно? Okay, I have to leave, but you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Sobel. Get changed. Here, our weapons and key card are in the bag. This way. Once we're in the bunker, we're on our own. Morsha pustish nas. Ladu. No metal detectors for us. We're going around. И куда это вы направляетесь? Досмотр обязателен. Для всех, без исключения. Вы должны пройти досмотр. Товарищ, доставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Пойдем он я нам копию Дайте нам пройти. Не принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. Товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. Поздравите, Белико. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Пойдем. Вы прибыли. Ах да, разумеется. Кто ваш командир? Я не расслышал. Вы что, с дураками не дерзите? Кто вы такие? Элевейтор conversation always gets awkward. Gear up. 
They won't be happy to see us down here. Wait for my word.
Price Bill. Plant a gas canister with that. Hurry up and set the gas. Lock's ticking, Bell. Plant the gas. Get to the vault. Almost to the vault. Copy it to a disk.
Keep moving. We need to find a way out. I know just the place, my friend.
about time. Been waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus. And the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who could bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods, don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit guarantee. I need a few minutes of your time to discuss something. Do available? In private. You ready? You look ready. We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park, anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and we were buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants at Yamatown, I want it more. The first building is just over that ridge. Thanks, Dimitri. We'll radio we found the mainframe. Woods, you know what the KGB does to double agents. Yep. 
Да. If they win this season, it's almost worth facing the fighting squad. Eh. Hey, I've only one hour of fuel. So after that, you find yourself a new ride. Come on, let's get moving, Mason. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar throw you. Belikov is the real deal. He knows... We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park? Anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and Weaver buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants in Yamatown, I want it more. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar throw you. Belikov is the real deal. He knows where all the bodies are buried. Hell, he buried half. Scouts on the ridge line. We should drop them now before we get any closer. Good kill. Nice. Let's keep moving. You take one, I'll get the other. Good kill. This looks dicey. But hey, if it's good enough, the Reds. <laughs> you go first. Time to pay Ivan a visit. Let's keep moving. Sniper, take cover! Shit. 
I can't get him out. Mason, take him out. Hudson. We finished analyzing that mainframe that Mason Woods brought from Yamato. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleeper agents Dragovich used in 68. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus erased them. Fuck me. There's only one place you're gonna find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know, but we're gonna do this the right way, we're not gonna do it at all. Just got word. Belikov is back in Moscow. You guys know the plan. Bell, you're with me. Lazar, be ready for exfil. Are you taking him into the KGB with you? Are you crazy? Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Bell. He's got the skill we need. Are you enjoying this? 
You're risking the entire... ...operation unnecessarily. About time. Been waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who could bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods, don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit. MI6 has spent the last year tracking a group of embedded Soviet agents within multiple European... Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. 
Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. In exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out. Adler's late. Now, love, we're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Park, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Do the honors, Bill. Let it go! Contact! Moving up! Like fucking clock! We have a team! Team, man up! Stay to the main gate! Sniper, up ahead!
Copy that. Let's move! Mark, take your team right. Copy. What did these poor bastards do? They finished their job. They love a reward. They've got closed-circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever, Mark. Spread out! Find that nuke! It's quiet all of a sudden. Stay sharp. Contact! Bell, sweep for mines. Say we finally grab that drink when this is over. Your persistence is admirable, Lazar. That's not a no. Jesus, get a fucking room, you two. Will come in handy. Get on the camera feeds, Bell. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Second floor, room 27B.
Second floor center room. Upstairs. Let's yeah. move. Take it there, Park. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. Second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up. Protejan el laboratorio. Hombre caído. Side. Bell canvassed the room. Hastings, start talking. <laughs> Perseus was here. <coughs> he shot us. He escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They'd give him full access to Greenland. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. I blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go, no? Contact! Chopper coming in low! It's gotta be Perseus! All teams head to the roof! Move! Adler, I got eyes on an HVT. South rooftop. Could be perfect. 
Perseus. He's climbing into a chopper. Lock it down. I'm a window. Out the window. Bell, let's go. Fuck me, the chopper got away. Fuck Perseus.
You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. a lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping Perseus. You always have to. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. Damn. The eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? Memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam, one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You 
ran forward and picked up an M16. Then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Good boy! 
again. You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. Bell, I need you to turn around and go into the cave. Bell's starting to drift. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the cave. You wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. Found the bunker by going into the cave. Why is Sims in scenario 17? A tunnel? You okay, you pulled out your sidearm and flashlight.
Stop lying, Bell. Start again and tell me how you met Perseus. Christ, what's happening to him? A mild seizure. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanting memories. We've got a job to do. Let's up the dosage and put one B this time. Okay, ready. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently.
Don't worry about the chopper, Bell. Just move forward with the story. That split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way back. He wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. Bell, turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. Equipped your shotgun and had a bow with you. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents.
Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. seizure. Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck! Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a BC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged it.
Sorry, Bell. You're telling us you died on this mission? You readied a grenade launcher. You charged it. Path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. Crossing a bridge near a village. Probably somewhere on the other side. At the fork, you followed the road right toward the sound of gunfire. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. He stirred up a hornet's nest. He chopped it. Roger that. Chopper inbound. ETA two minutes.
Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck. Open it. Give Bell another injection. That could be... Do it, now! Bell's heart rate is already... Heart rate is spiking. I'm not sure how much longer Bell can last. Good. Everything's stabilizing. Heart rate is coming down. Stop wasting my time with this hallway. about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume survive another round. Now you're asking me. Do it. We're not leaving empty-handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell, you've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead. The, next one. the bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. Bell, open the door.
only one who knows where Perseus is. Where he'll detonate the nukes. Where is he, Bell? Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. Bullshit is what your whole life will amount to if you don't come clean. Tell us where Perseus is. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. When the plane leaves traps on his sobbing in Duba, this you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition.
The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, you've got a job to do. Come on, you've got a job to do. You've got a job to do. You've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind the door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the team of Perseus, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovets. This is your chance to find who you really are now. Where is Perseus? Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now. Soviet armor. Locked on, you thought I was. No way I'm missing this. Motherfuckers are gonna pay for Isla Lazard. 